Real coffee. Smell it. Got this at an auction? It was a total bargain. Been keeping it at my friend Bryony's place. Getting in the way there, was it? Who wants first cappuccino? Yeah, I can froth the milk. All right. One cup of this and you're so never going to want instant again. <laughs> yes, we'll see. Well, I'll have a double macchiato. Good, I'm glad to see your education wasn't entirely wasted. Let's hope that's just a fuse. I'm getting back to work. Me too. This is so not my day. Good to see you this morning. Just wanted to make sure all the stock were watered before it got too late. Fair enough, but you've got to remember to let someone know what you're up to. I think it's just better to get the work done instead of wasting time talking about it. Gee, I thought I was the boss. Fix it. Don't tell me your hair dryer. This place is stuffed, Claire. You cannot blame me. God, it's like every morning we're out checking the fences, checking the troughs. We're checking them. What about the house? It doesn't take care of itself either. The roof leaks, the plumbing sucks. If the electricity is that temperamental, we're lucky the place hasn't burnt down. If someone neglected one of your stupid cows the way you neglect this house, you would have a brain hemorrhage. I don't suppose you had anything to do with it. What? The house fusing out. Nothing at all to do with that stupid machine in the kitchen. It's an espresso maker. I thought you'd like it. Tess, I don't want to hear it. And I'm not going to take advice from you on how to run the place. Fine. Where are you going? I want a cappuccino. Great. Useless piece of crap. All right, so now you leave. I can tell she's one of Sirocco's. <laughs> yeah, she's a beauty. Yeah, doesn't like to be penned up. No. Becky's mum. Great. Get a bit drafty in here. I like it. But it isn't home, is it? It is now. Beck. I want you to come back. I just told you this is my home now. I miss you. Oh. I remember when you were little. And your dad would do his block over something, and I'd be outside crying, and there you were, bringing me out tissues. 
run through a lot of those. I could always count on you. Pity I can't say the same back. I know I haven't been the best mum in the world, but... You're my daughter. I miss you and I want you to come home. Where are you off to? Town. Oh, picking up supplies, are you? Getting a coffee? Saddle? You're not going to try and ride her yet, are you? No, I just want to get her used to it first. Mum wants me to go back home. She says she needs me. Hey, but we need you too. This about this morning? No, Mum asked me. I don't want to leave you in the lurch. Hey, who else am I supposed to talk to? Jody. It's family. Funny, is it, huh? Huh? Get away from me, don't you dare. Come and look at this. Yeah, right, like I'm getting out. No, you've done your axle. Come and have a look. No, that's all I need. <laughs> <laughs> Ow, <man. laughs> <laughs> Sure, that's not cow dung. Welcome, welcome. Hi, how are you, Harry? All the better for seeing you, Tess. Tess? You're Claire's sister. Oh, sorry, Mum. Tess Silverman, this is my mum, Liz. Hi. Oh, I didn't know places like this existed anymore. I think I might have to use the servants' entrance. Oh, no. Yes, I've been hearing a lot about you. But I was under the impression you were only here on a short stay. It really depends how long Claire and I can go without killing each other. Yeah, I can imagine that. So, where's this spa bath you've been telling me about, Alex? Oh, right out this one. Ah. Oh, my God. A new living in the country couldn't be all bad. Oh, this is a shampoo.
who I use. And conditioner. I've died and gone to heaven. If you'd like to leave your dirty clothes outside the door, I'll take care of them for you. Thank you. Oh. <laughs>